Here is one of the most powerful content marketing strategies that is guaranteed to send 300% more traffic to your website for free. Today, not only will I teach you how to increase brand awareness and drive traffic, but I will also show you how to use a free tool that practically does all the hard work for you. And also, if you stay until the end, I'll give you a free series that will show you the secret method that I use to get over 30,000 website visitors every day for free. And that has allowed my students to generate enormous levels of wealth for themselves and for their families. Okay, so today's strategy is all about something called content repurposing. And if you haven't heard of that before, it's essentially when we take existing content and we change the format two or three times. So that allows us to put this new content in front of two or three more groups of people. So we can grow an audience three times the size with really a lot less effort than creating brand new content. So if you want to see a good example of how this is done, then take a look at what Gary V is doing and he has mastered it, but he does have a team of around 16 people, I think working round the clock, churning out content for him 24 seven. Now you don't need a team of people to do this because I've simplified the entire process for you. I've made it really easy to do so anyone can do it and they can do it for free. So let's go to the computer. I'll show you the strategy and then I'll show you how to implement it. Okay. Let me map this out for you because this is how to get 300% more traffic. So let's start with what we might usually have first is a blog post. So that is think of it as a column, one column. And then in the second one, what we can do is turn that blog post into a video. So we would typically upload that to maybe YouTube. So that becomes a second column and the third column. Well, we take that video and extract the audio from it. So it becomes a podcast. And I'm going to show you an example of all this in a second, but we don't stop here. So these are the, the three main columns that we use. But in each of these columns, we can then break it down even further. So for example, when it comes to blog posts, we can take sections or, or sentences from that and convert it into maybe images or memes. So let's put an M for memes with videos. What we can do is take trailers or teaser clips and then add them to TikTok or Instagram. So let's put a T on there for teasers with podcasts. You can extract paragraphs or sentences and they can become sound bites. Now, if we were to map out the flow, let's draw it out so you can see actually how it works. So if we were to drag in a blog post here and let's increase the size so you can see it, let's also drag in a landing page. So this is how it works. You would send traffic from your blog post to your landing page. So that's how you're going to get people onto your email list. That's how you're going to make money from things like affiliate marketing or your own products or your own services. And when we repurpose content, so let's say we turn the blog post into a YouTube video. We also send traffic from YouTube to your landing page. And again, if we have a podcast, guess what we do? We send everything from these content columns to your landing page. And if you want to see an example of this, well, just take a look at one of my websites, Profit Copilot. Here you can see that we've got a video. So if I click play on this, there is my devilishly handsome face. And you can see, you can see that, whoops, let me just escape that a second. So this video is really just this blog post and underneath the video, we have a podcast version. I like to start with video because that is my preferred content creation method, but you can start with a blog post if you prefer, and then just convert that into a video. So just read it out on camera if you have to, or do an explainer video or hire someone else to do it on Fiverr. Now 
you add all these columns into one location. So on your blog post, you now embed your video, you embed your podcast as well. And notice at the end of my blog posts, and you should do this too, you also have a call to action. And that's how I structure mine. Okay, so we don't stop here. We can then take little clips from this or take a quote from, from the article. And then let's say it's video. So we take a small clip. We can upload that to Instagram and then we can link to the blog post from Instagram. So this small piece of content on Instagram acts as a teaser. And then if they want to get the rest, then they can visit your website or you can take this YouTube video and upload that as is to Instagram TV, or you could turn it into an image. You could take a sentence or a quote, turn it into an image, upload it to Pinterest and then point back to your blog post. Now, why wouldn't you link directly to your landing page? Well, you can do that. And in some instances, you're going to get good results, but you need to test this for yourself. If the content that you're posting on Instagram or Pinterest or wherever is highly relevant to that landing page, then yeah, that's going to probably work out pretty well for you. But if there is a little bit of a disconnect between this piece of content and the opt-in page, the landing page, it's not going to work. So that's why we link, whoops, that's why we link to the blog post as well, because there, then there is no disconnect. So what I would strongly suggest is just test it out for yourself because what works for someone else might not necessarily work for you. So that's the basic strategy. So we break things up, break it down into smaller chunks and then make it relevant for each platform. So to do that, we're going to use a free tool. Let me log out of this so you can see the copy for yourself. The first thing it says is where content creation happens. Let me show you some of the tools that it gives you free access to. So if you click on tools, check this out. It is crazy, right? All this, all these tools that will do the work for you are completely free to use. Not only that, I mean, they do have a, a premium option. Check this out. So the free option costs nothing, obviously, but they have a pro version for 20 bucks a month. 20 bucks a month is nothing, right? But if we go down to check this out, where is it? I really can't afford to pay. Are there any other options? Check this out. So if you run a, a website or a blog, you can write an article that shares information about Capwing and they will upgrade your account for free. Now I have contacted these guys and I've asked them for more information about this. This is what they told me. They will give one free account in exchange for an original product review on a website. They expect it to be at least 500 words of original content. You have to have one screenshot or photo and you need to add one do follow backlink to the website and you must have Capwing in the title of the article. So I think that's OK. That's a pretty good deal in my book. And full disclaimer, I am an affiliate of Capwing because I believe in the product and I only ever recommend products and tools I personally use. So when you sign up, you've got a few options here so you can create a new workspace. So if you want to drag in a piece of content, a video, an image, you can start there. However, on the left hand side, we have tools and under tools, we have templates. So if you click on that, it's going to give you a whole bunch of memes that somebody else has made and you can just go ahead and start editing them. If you want content for social media, if you want that shareability factor, then you can just go ahead and make these kind of memes. So this one, so it's, it's a kid running away from their responsibilities. So you could adapt this for your niche. So healthy eating or whatever might be relevant at the moment. It could be, you know, Black, Black Friday offers 
Anyway, tons of memes to choose from. That's going to increase brand awareness. Now, when it comes to making teaser videos, if we go to, if we go to all tools, if we go down to trim video, we can actually import videos from YouTube. So what you could do is after you've done this strategy, so you have these columns, you've uploaded your video to YouTube, just paste in the URL here. Let me show you. There we go. Okay. So what I could do is just take out a segment of this video. Let me pause that. So if I want to go to, let's say, I just want to show someone how to use an app. I can just drag the timeline there to the right part like that. And then I can drag this down to the right length. So if you're uploading to Instagram and you're not using Instagram TV, you want to make sure that the output here is less than a minute. And I believe the same is for TikTok. So if we're happy with that, we can click done. It's going to allow us to save that video and now it's being exported. So it might take a couple of minutes for that to happen. And once that downloads, we can now change the dimensions because we want to make sure that all our content is made specifically for each platform that we promote it on. So we've used the video trimmer to reduce the length. But now if we go to resize video, this is so easy to use so we can upload the video that we've, we've just made, or we can again, paste in a URL from YouTube or somewhere else. So let me show you how to do that. So I'm just going to paste in one of my videos. There we go. So now I can make sure that the dimensions are right for Instagram or TikTok or wherever else. I choose. And if we go back a second, you can just select which template. And when you are consistent with this type of structure, this strategy, who knows what kind of amazing results you can get. Like Matt, he's one of my students who is making millions of dollars online thanks to my training. So if you want to know the secret and you really are serious about growing a popular and profitable internet business, you're going to need traffic. So I will give you the traffic methods that I never share on YouTube or anywhere else. You can get them all for free when you go to profitcopilot.com slash traffic. And I'll put a link to that in the description. And if you found this useful, give it a thumbs up below, subscribe to the channel too, hit that little notification bell. So you never miss an update from me. And I will hopefully see you again in a couple of days time. Take care.